Hey, Poker Party people! This is Sky with SmartPokerStudy.com, and I'm here today with a video to show you how to edit the hand tags available to you within Poker Tracker 4. I was actually in the middle of a blog post all about the importance of uh, note taking, and it occurred to me that I could add a hand tag in Poker Tracker 4 that would help me with my off the table note taking. So, in this video, I'll cover the following bullet points, the importance of tagging hands for later review, where to find the default tags available in Poker Tracker 4, how to edit the tags to suit your own uh, post-game reviews and your own needs while you're, you know, in the middle of playing your games, and how to filter for specific tags. Now, uh, we all know why you want to tag hands for later review. Most of us multi-table anywhere from six or more tables, and while doing that, we don't really have the time to dissect and fully understand key spots that give us trouble while we're playing. Uh, reviewing these hands during our off-the-felt study time allows us to do the math, run the numbers, range our opponents, and spend as much time on a spot in order to fully understand it. Plus, we can discuss these hands with friends and post them in forums, ask for advice, or even get critiques from other players on on our play. Um, I configured my tags in PT4 in the past, uh, and let me show you what those are right now. So the first thing we do, if we go up to configure and then tags, so these are the tags, the tags that I have. They are much different from your standard or from your default tags within Poker Tracker 4. And these are the ones I'm currently using. And I realized as I was writing that blog post about note taking that I can put a new tag in place that will help me to exploit my opponents even more than I'm currently doing. Um, that's going to be called the note taking tag. This will ensure that I review a hand where an opponent made a mistake. So I can take note of that mistake in order to exploit that opponent, uh, you know, in future hands. This is is really well against regs but also it works well against um all those you know fishy players that you encounter a lot but they're just not that good they play one table at a time the more you know about all your fish and your regs the better off you'll be in exploiting them you know uh, most of my current tags that you can see are kind of related to me or my play in a hand but this new tag will ensure that i look at my opponent's play even more than i currently do um, I guess you can consider an interesting tag, maybe looking at opponent's plays, but this one will be a little bit different. Cool beans is good stuff that I did. Good play is just a questionable play on my part. But let's select a pick, and let's go with elephant, because, of course, elephants never forget. And one of the reasons why we want to make these tags is so that we uh, remember these possible exploits on opponents. You know, So let's call it the newt taking tag hit OK and then BAM there it is just hit close now it's within your tags in the system um, if you want to filter for the tag of course uh, you know more filters hand details hand is tagged as here's all the different tags that I have note taking which is the sp specific one we just made add it to filter and then there it is save and apply filters I'm not going to do that right now because there's really just no point because I just now created the tag haven't used it yet but let's show you what it looks like when we just run another tag um, tagged hands for review now we're looking at one week here so I would estimate maybe what two per night I might have 14 you know 20 tags at wow 30 tags great plenty of hands to review within this one week of play which is uh, about a month ago now but yeah, so basically that's how it works right there. Um, so I think that's really it for this video. I hope it helps you to tailor Poker Tracker 4 to suit your own specific needs. Stay tuned for lots of future videos from me on this and many other topics. Uh, if you'd like to get Poker Tracker 4 as a free 30-day trial, please visit the link in the show notes below or go directly to smartpokerstudy.com slash PT-4 to be taken to the sign-up page, which is my own affiliate account with Poker Tracker 4. I get a little kickback if you sign up for it there. Um, if you enjoyed this video and learned something from it, please like it below and subscribe to my channel. The more likes I get, the more videos I'll do on the same or, you know, even related subject matter. Uh, if you'd like to visit my Poker Study strategy blog, you can go to www.smartpokerstudy.com. Check me out also on Twitter at Smart Poker Study. And I really do appreciate you spending some of your poker studying time with me today. And I hope this video helps you improve your game. Uh, until next time, study hard and make your next session the best one yet.